Hey everyone, welcome back to the His and Hers of Truth podcast. This is my beautiful wife. Sim, great seeing you on, seeing everyone again. Kat. <laughs> there you go, it's live. So <laughs> Yeah, we're doing it live, guys. There's no retakes. My yeah. name is Tuan Wright. Guys, yeah. hey, please subscribe to the channel while you're here. Mm -hmm. We've seen the recent uptick in subscriptions, so thank you so much. Yes. However, there's still a bunch of shadow watchers out there, so no quit shadow, shadow watching, watching, right? <laughs> if you guys love our videos, especially this Asian content, guys, mm -hmm. because this is going to be, I really think this is, year and moving forward this is going to be the change that all our asian brothers and sisters of course need to see. are going to need to do to get better outcomes for mm -hmm. everyone okay guys also smash the like button while you're here Boom. turn on the notification bell Ding. right sorry we've been usually posting content every yep. month i'm uh, sorry tuesdays and thursdays at mm -hmm. 6 p.m uh, we had some recent moves, so we got kind of a little bit busy, but yeah. we're bringing it back to you guys once again. And of course, check out our lives that we are planning some more lives in the future with you know, great guests. Yeah. And of course, just discussing the truth and of course, Asian content with it. Guys, watch the whole video and of course, share and comment at the end. Mm -hmm. We love every comment. We got to kind of figure out a way to react to all the comments yes. in the future, guys. We love want to answer because I know there's been some good questions of late. Uh -huh. and so I think we need to come up with maybe a better way. Maybe we'll do a show, a live show where we just answer all your guys' comments. Yeah. And then maybe you guys can, you know, text yeah, us or email us comments mm -hmm. during the show as well, too. Yeah. OK, anyways, guys, this is going to be part two of a video we just recently shot. Right. And the title of the video was how Japan's sexlessness affects its women. Mm -hmm. Guys, it was a long video, but please go watch it. I think there was so much good content in there yeah. relating to our Asian struggle, if yeah. you want to call it, that we're dealing with right now in the Western world. Turtle. And so even though Japan has faced this for decades now, and now it's starting to, you know, like obviously Emerge. really become an issue, mm -hmm. I'm telling you guys, this is related to kind of just all our Asian cultures in general. Okay, guys, so this is going to be part two. Looking forward to it. の世代ですか<笑> Okay, so real quick, what do you think about that whole first part, right? Where that prawn star, she was a, a housewife. Yeah. I don't know if she's a former or she's still currently with her husband. Who knows? Yeah. Yeah. But the point is she turned to porn to oh, alleviate, sorry. right? Mm -hmm. Her her sexless marriage. Yeah. So what do you think about that whole MILF comment that she had, honey? Yeah, she's like, well, hey, if you're looking if you're looking at it's MILF, it's similar to my age. Why aren't you just sleeping with your own wife? So what you do you know? think about and, that? And I guess, in turn, I guess you know most of the husbands miss if communication not communicating with their wives of what their sexual drives are or or you know being turned on by their wife this is why they're sexless and yeah. they're looking at prawn stars as something of their sort of fantasy ish you know i drive. think i think this is a multi-tiered like this is a multi-tiered problem when she's stating that a lot of men are into milk porn yeah and guess what guys Think about it. a lot of men in every society, Western mm -hmm. society is into milk prawn as well too, mm -hmm. right? So what does that tell you? One, obviously the men are not alpha and they're not telling their women like, this is what I want, right? But two, the women, like I said, and this is an Asian cultural really thing, I think as well too. I think it's in general, a human issue right because men and women don't communicate when they get into and marriages and then kids. but and then of course what do we talk about all the time when you get married you let yourself go That's and you just daddy. start becoming complacent so instead of like mm -hmm. the woman like you said multiple times honey right dressing yourself up mm -hmm. being sexy to your husband you don't you just expect mm -hmm. oh let's you know it's it's a quiet evening right i just got done with the laundry let's have sex real quick no that's not he, gonna turn him on he doesn't want that you know like and, because think about it. When they're watching prawn stars, right? What are these women doing? They're, okay, they're, they're looking good. And they're building they're a fantasy. It's, they're a, it's building, a fantasy. Yeah. They're, they're, you know, they're, they're dressing up nice. They're, you know, uh, you know, then they undress here and there just a little They're bit. playing okay? the part too. Yeah, yeah, they're playing that part. But when, when you're a wife and, you know, you're, you're wearing ugly clothes, you don't smell good. Your hair is like undone. How's that? 
for a man to find you sexy. Yeah. I mean, it's, as a woman, I wouldn't even find you sexy. It, like, you know, or him handsome it's, if he's it's, in it's, it's crappy a two, clothes. It's a two-prong two two prong process because yeah. to get... The, the, I definitely put blame on the women for not doing it, right? Yeah. I mean, I think it's part of you. If you want to talk about duty in our Asian culture, I really think part of the duty as a wife is to do that for your mm -hmm. husband, right? But let's be honest. Women are obviously very emotional and obviously very based on their feelings, right? To get that arousal attraction, and this is the reason why I love these videos, because we need to talk about how it relates to our Asian society. Mm -hmm. well, guys, Asian brothers, we don't pull that reaction mm -hmm. from our Asian women yeah right because all you guys do is focus on finance yeah and you guys don't pull that arousal that lust nope. from your asian women right you're just beta you're short or whatever like i said it's a two-way street it yeah. really is i told you that already もう主婦の方から普通の会社員の方まで、もう本当にいろいろいろな方がご利用されています。どういったこう理由でまあ、一つはあの性欲の解消。でもそれよりもあとあの心の癒しとかなんか肉体的なあの快感とかそういったものだ
right? And all we care about is freaking, you know, uh, having kids, yeah. right? Per se, having kids. Someone. But but we forgot to like why. Yeah. And 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 how? Like mm -hmm. how's like just having kid is one thing, but you know, like think about it, guys. Think about the way you were raised as an Asian kid, mm -hmm. right? Think about growing up, right? Did your parents tell you, oh, you need to do this? Mm -hmm. Right? Do they say, oh, hey, you know, you need to become stronger, bigger. You need to be able to become athletic. You need to be going outgoing. No. You need to become a leader, right, as a man. Yeah. Do they tell you, oh, by the way, you know, you better freaking work on these other attributes instead of just your schooling? I bet you they didn't. Yeah. I bet you they only had you guys. I don't care where in Asia most Asian parents tell you to focus, especially the men, just to focus on making money, just study hard, just study, study, study. Mm -hmm. They don't have no playtime. They don't, they don't have you work out. They don't have you uh, be, you know, dressed nice be hygienic, whatever. They don't focus on that. And my, that's why you guys have bad my, teeth and all and that other And my Asian stuff. brothers, let me dress, ask. Don't dress well. Let, let me hit you in the heart real quick, and my Asian brothers. It's let me, the truth. Let me ask, let me, because as an Asian guy, I grew up with this myself too. There was a point in time, I know that you felt this, is, you felt when your parents told you this or other family members, older family members in your Asian yeah. society told yeah. you this, you were like, why, mm -hmm. why am I doing this? Yeah. Do you want me to become this? You want me to become that? You want yeah. me to be good at school, but why? Yeah. I know you guys, my Asian brothers, you have felt this out there. Yeah. And that's the thing I'm telling you guys, we have lost our way mm -hmm. as an Asian community. We don't know what the truth is anymore. We don't know what the values are to get the truth. Yeah. And these are our outcomes, right? And we had, let's be honest, Asian brothers, I just told you guys like on the last we had the best outcomes. We had the most desired women mm -hmm. in ethnicity, the most you feminine, guys are letting it go. the thinnest, mm -hmm. right? The least overweight, right? The most nurturing. Yep. Right? Not anymore. The youngest looking, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, on historically, Asians in general look younger than everybody else, mm -hmm. right? But you're about to lose it all. いや。その前はでも、夫は仕事のことは理解して、同人AV な活動も理解しているあの、仕事と趣味の融合みたいな風に私思ってるので、だから不倫は違ったんですよ。ま、私の友達でも不倫した人いるんですけど、そしたらもう家庭崩壊なんですよね。結局その元から思っ<笑> 私、女だったんだみたいな。そういうのは出てきました。今のご主人、ご存知。知らないと思いますね。そういう話はしないんですよ。ま、仕事を出かけるのは多いなとは思ってると思うんですけど、ま、何してるとかは言わない。ま、ど
どうせ私のこと嫌いなんでしょうみたいな態度で接してたと思うんですけど、まあ、そういうことは言わないというか。Okay, so what do you thought about that whole、oh, crazy cu-、uh, statement? <laughs> Honey, there was a lot in this segment, but I did. I personally have one thing that I want to touch on. What, what about you? They're crazy. How is it not cheating? You're a porn star, and then now you're And you didn't you tell him.、Cheat. Yeah. And、it's、you like, didn't tell him. It'd like, be one thing if you told him, hey, honey, you know, we're not having sex anymore. Obviously, you don't find me attractive. So, you know what? Head, like, what is these women thinking? You're a porn star. You don't. And then if the husband's cheating, or you're. you're that's considered cheating, girl. I don't know what else to say. Like, you're deceiving him.、Uh, you know, when it comes to a relationship, should be honest. If you're a porn star and you're freaking proud of your damn job, then you would have just say, hey, I'm a porn star. You know what I mean? I don't like、yeah. that. I, I'll be I, honest I cannot with you. condone that. Let's say that. I don't condone that shit. <laughs> But what about, what about, I mean, you compare her situation to the first lady who let her husband know,、yeah. and he's cool with it. What、They're、do you think? They're both crazy. Yeah. Like, I'm sorry to say, I, okay, if, if my. You already man, lost. You already, already lost, lost as a husband. Like, dude,、yeah. like, what the hell are you thinking? She's sleeping with somebody every freaking damn day. She ain't a wife anymore. A wife in a relationship is commitment to each other. That isn't commitment like that. Well, like this, that, into that, this, and you're still okay with it. This, and then this, here she's thinking it's cheating, guys, like a it, reversing cheating dude. You're sleeping with everybody, and now your husband finds out, and you're thinking, oh, cheating, but he can't cheat. No, you're freaking prom star. That is not okay, girl. Like, you're crazy. Well, like, the, I don't know, they're stupid the, the or two, something in the, the damn head. The two things that really pointed out to me was one, oblivious right, enough. We, we, can... Like I said, guys, this is just another clear reminder. Wow. This is another clear <sighs> reminder that we have lost sight of our values and the truth. Right?、Wow. Because, like, like, we talk about a man that is willing to let his wife go and have sex with other people knowingly, her values. Giving her values to away、everybody. to someone else doesn't know what those values are and has lost sight of the truth. Because if you knew what the truth was, you would know that those values were supposed to be committed, yeah, like my wife said, said, to one another. Yeah. And then the second thing I wanted、oh, to take on、wow. was that, guys, what did I tell you? Asian women are no different than other women.、Yep. My Asian brothers, you guys thought. Right? You guys have been lied to that this Asian structure has told us、you、that、like、Asian women are this and Asian、like、women that. that and Asian s supposed to be this way and we're supposed to be that way. Guys,、they're、what、like、did I tell、channel. you? That structure has <laughs> broken. Fallen. Fallen. Right?、Honey. And women, yeah, women are going to be women.、Mm-hmm. And that's clearly the case that you guys are seeing here、yeah. with what's going on. Wow. 女性は結構考えすぎちゃっているんだけど男の人には全然伝わってなかったからその辺をやっぱりちゃんとこう勇気を出して自分の本当の気持ちを言っていかないと全然相手には伝わってないんだなっていうことは悩んでる女性はすごいあると思います。あとはもうお互いに一旦受け取る受け入れるだってもう絶対それぞれのことを思って言ってくれてるはずだからっていうなんか花からいや,いやいやっていうのをやめてるっていう歩み寄るとかっていうのをお互いに。やってるっていうのもありますか。言ったら愛の形はセックスだけじゃないのと思ってるので、あのそうじゃなくても例えばしっかり会話するとかお互い思いやるっていう気持ちがあれば問題なくあのやっていけると思うんですよ皆さん。強制するものじゃないので。お互いが理解示してしないするするのかそれともせずにも他例えばハグとかキスだけでもいいしありがとうっていう言葉を述べるとかそんなんでもいいですけど解決策はもう本当に夫婦って同じ方向を見て歩かないといけないので、yeah. 歩み寄り以外はないと思いますね。そこはあんまりできなかった。性についてはだからもうその時断られた時にもう私がへこんじゃったので仲が悪いわけじゃないんですよ普通に会話もするけれどもまあ愛情表現が下手な人なのかありがとうとかそういうのもあんまり言われないんですよ一方的に私がこの人のこと好きなのかなっていうふうに思ってで例えばそれに対して口が下手なんだったら他セックスだったりとか何かで返してくれたらわかるんですけどそうじゃないことが多分私の場合は良くなかったというかかなと思いますね。わかんないんですよね相手の気持ちが
I don't care for you no more. I'll tell you that. なんか、やっぱ、うん、でも相手になんか嫌われてるのか、ただの社員なのかわからないからなんか行けないっていう自分もいてて。はいはい。いや、ないですね。AV業界に入ったことは自分にとって良かったと思ってます。それに対してね、
maybe the kid would have at least focused him. Because I know as a man myself, right, I became way more focused mm -hmm. once I knew I was a dad, yeah. as a father. Yep. Right? And I get it. It's more. you have to step up your responsibility. But you got to step up, right? Mm -hmm. Like, I, I get that, like, maybe, like, I have less time for my wife, right? Mm -hmm. But the thing about it, guys, is if you're doing everything, and this is a trick for, guy, for guys and gals out there, right? We've been married over 20-something years, right? Less time, honey. We see each other every freaking yes. day. Seven days and, a week, and, guys. And what does, that, and what, and what does that tell you? As long as your significant yeah. others know that you are doing your best part for yep. the family, mm -hmm. that's where that validation comes in. Yeah. They know that you're, you your validate part. them mm -hmm. because why would you have to bust your butt so much to do it? If you didn't validate them, you just go, go to the bar, drink, yep. and do whatever. Well, that's what I'm just saying. Right? Yeah. If, if your wife didn't validate you, she won't be taking care of the kids, right? Being at home, doing all the duties that a wife mm -hmm. and a mom is supposed to do. Yeah. And then, of course, obviously having sex every once in a while yeah. with you as much as you can because you guys are so busy. But the point is, it's not just sex. Remember how many times throughout these videos they kept mm -hmm. on saying it's not just this about sex? How many, I said that to you guys the last video right mm -hmm. it's not about sex it's about this validation and the validation guys i always keep telling you people people construe it with love and emotions and mm -hmm. feelings no it's about doing your, your duty mm -hmm. to raise your kids the best you can and when giving you, the best outcome correct and when you do that it validates mm -hmm. your you. your existence yep you as both a of you guys mm -hmm. you okay? that's why i said you as a parent it validates both you and your parent but your also, husband's role his leadership and everything but else also validates to each you other as, well, but wife. also to each other yeah because guys that's the thing as long as you it's, it's basically this as long as you are providing the values mm -hmm. towards the truth you're going to be fulfilled you're going to be validated you're going to be happy we need to stop using all these vague terms yeah. to describe love, that, that stuff, right? Stuff. No, no, it's it's, it's just bringing, bringing what you're supposed, supposed to bring to, to the table, right? We talk about bringing stuff to the table all this time in this this modern context, right? Bring what you're supposed to bring to the table. Not yourself only. Right, exactly. You're not the table, <laughs> yeah. right? You're supposed to bring these values to the table yeah. and you'll be happy. You'll be yeah. validated. Yeah. You'll have each other's vibe. You'll have yeah. each other's connection, right? You'll have each other's communication. Mm -hmm. That's really what it is. It's that simple. It is simple. Okay. And, you know, it's nothing like hidden or s secrets out there, people. Okay. If you do your thing, you do your part, you up your game as a man, you as a woman, keeping yourself slim. Hey, remember when you were trying to attract that guy, what did you do? Come on. We were yeah. all there. Okay. We tried to fix ourselves up. We made ourselves smell good. We took a shower. We dressed nice. Do the same shit over and over for your freaking husband, the one that's sacrificing his life and time for you. Why the hell you guys got to prep yourself up only for your girls day, night, night? day night out only do it every freaking day for your you know the man that is providing for you that way your kids respect you know what they're seeing yeah. okay don't validate for other men validate for the man that is providing and sacrificing himself and that's what you women need to see and do because you know what other men just wants to see and bang you but your man that's sacrificing bring the dough the narrow taking care of your freaking kids sacrifice his life so do it for your husband, not other men out there. Do it for yourself because you need to hear. He's your number one fan. He's the one you got to make sure is attracted to you 24-7. Okay? So there. That's I'm, it. I'm not going to say any more. That was I'm bars. Down. That was that was awesome, guys. Love you guys. I think See that was it. a great video. Guys, watch both parts because there was a lot of useful content in there. Yep. Hope you guys get better results in 2023 True. and 2024. We love you. So change. Yep. See you guys next See time. Ya. Bye. Bye. Join us as we give you guys a glimpse into our lives, give you guys advice, mm -hmm. hopefully give you guys entertainment value as well too, and provide you guys better outcomes. Yes.